Welcome to Happiest Places Home, the interior design channel. Today we're shopping at Walmarts for fabulous dupes for Pottery Barn, one for Crate and Barrel, one for CB2, and just a lot of fun design finds. So I can't wait to show you we have furniture, an abundance of uh, throw pillows, and then some kitchen items. I just can't even tell you. So let's just get started. These are looks at Pottery Barn um, items that we have dupes for coming up. Here we go. When we take a look at this lovely room, it's featuring on the left the Balboa Swivel Chair by Pottery Barn. And it's such a gorgeous piece. It's massive, very wide, so you can actually curl up with a book and just get cozy. And the swivel aspect I'll talk about, but you'll notice they are offering it in quite a few colors because color is in more than cream is at the moment, but they definitely still do offer cream and um, that fits in with most decor styles, of course. But if you're looking at those 2024 trends, there's a lot of color. But Walmart has a dupe for this, and it's the Drew Chair by Drew Barrymore. It's a swivel chair and $298 compared to the $1849. So both of these are 40 inches wide, and I put similar fabric to get that price comparison because there are a number of different prices for the Balboa. So Drew's chair at Walmart is stain-treated boucle fabric. It's an extra large seat, like I said. You get three accent pillows with it, which I think is necessary. That would be a hard back. And then it does swivel 360 degrees. And what's nice about that, no matter who you buy a swivel chair from, is that you can kind of change areas. It's really great if you have a spectacular view and the chair can face conversations or you could sit and have a coffee or a wine and, and look out at your beautiful view. So Drew's chair also comes in a sage green, which is on sale for $248 versus the $298 of the cream. So this is a very popular chair uh, in cream on um, all kinds of outlets like TikTok and Instagram. Um, so I probably am not the first person to have shown you it, but I definitely needed to include it in this video for doing Pottery Barn dupes. Let's do another piece of furniture. I'm really excited about this one. So this is the Pottery Barn Cayman uh, coffee table and it's so beautiful. It was featured in the fall and it's featured so much in the spring in a lighter color, which you already saw. And here's another look at it. You can actually buy two pieces of it if you like to have that staggered look. But I have a dupe for the single piece, this one. And you could see why this would be featured in spring and summer. It does look very beachy. All right, so take a look at the Walmart Queer Eye Liam Round coffee table. It's only $104. Obviously, the materials for Pottery Barn are superior, but you're saving $595, which is excellent. I thought it was important to show you this CB2 coffee table. It's cast resin and it's supposed to look like a postmodern piece. Um, it's hand molded, just like Pottery Barn always says, and it's got this beautiful matte black finish, but it's also very wide, 50 inches. Well, Mar Walmart happens to have an excellent dupe for this, and I thought I needed to show you the comparison, but this is another uh, table by Drew Barrymore, and hers has a faux speckled marble finish. Um, so it's not exactly the same. It's also slimmer. It's a 40 inch in diameter, which I think would probably suit most households better anyway. But it's a wood construction. It's got a three leg base. Um, you do have to assemble it yourself. It's a really gorgeous piece for $228, very artsy. And if you did compare this to CB2, you're saving $1,500. I featured this art piece by Pottery Barn in I think two or three videos before, but I did see this great dupe at Walmart and I thought I should share it. Now this thing has been around for a while, so it's not like a smashing new piece, but you'll be excited about the price. So Pottery Barn's reclaimed wooden knot is $199. And then compare that to the Mainstays indoor tabletop resin piece. So this is $9.98. That's quite a savings. 
Pottery Barn has a new and fun table lamp called Edith, and it looks mid-century to me. Um, I'm sure it does to you as well. And it's a really beautiful piece at $329, but I found two dupes at Walmart that were fun. They don't look exactly like it, but I think that you could appreciate the price. I'm going to show you the one that I think looks higher quality first, and it's this one by Norison. So this has more of a tapered base than the Pottery Barn one does. Um, but what I thought was interesting about this one is the material looks exactly the same. So you're saving $269 with that one. The Better Homes and Gardens brand at Walmart has one also, and you'll save $284 with this one. The thing that I think is super interesting about this one is it's an easy touch on and off switch. So it's kind of like in a um, hotel room where you tap the lamp to turn it off. I think that's a fun feature. I always love it. I want one of those, don't have it. Anyway, so this one also has a tulip bottom, which makes it a little bit more mid-century. I think it's very pretty. So almost any furniture retailer has a chair that looks similar to this. It looks like a mid-century look as well. Um, and they have them in different heights, different widths, different colors. So I'm going to show you this Walmart modern armchair with solid wood frame at only $109.99. It is regularly $217 there, and it's sold at a number of retailers. The maker of this sells through like Wayfair and Target, but this is the lowest price you can get for this chair anywhere, and it is a limited time price, so I thought I better show it. But there it is side by side also with a West Elm chair, just to give you an idea. It's not necessarily a dupe, just a fantastic deal. You're looking at Pottery Barn's Svizzle glass, pure white wine glass. It is a shape that is very popular and has been for like a year, but I found a great dupe at Walmart for this. It's such a fabulous price. This is the Joy Jolt Layla Crystal White Wine Glass. So it is 100% crystal. And this is their large wine glass. Um, and it comes in a set of four boxed for $29.95. Flat bottom wine glasses have been in style for a really long time. In fact, they sold them at um, the Dollar Tree for a dollar a few years ago. And I'm so angry at myself that I didn't buy them when I saw them, but they don't have them anymore. Anyway, people are very partial to this shape. I don't know what it is, but I am as well. So I have a great dupe for the Pottery Barn one. So it's the brand Joy Jolt again, and this is their Claire Crystal White Wine Glass. And you can buy two for $19.90 boxed, um, but for comparison's sake, I showed you what it would be like for four, and that's a nice savings. Well, this time around, I'm showing you something that wasn't originally found as a dupe. I just thought it was so beautiful when I saw it. So this is the Time and Table Walmart 13-piece kitchen knife set. The wood block is very narrow and slim, so that's really great for saving space on your counter, unless you have the linear type, which I have, but I would prefer this one for sure. So it's acacia wood. I love the tone of that wood, and they have ergonomic handles and quite a few high-quality knives. It gets very high ratings, um, so anyway. And it says it's top rack dishwasher safe, but I think most knives say that, and I put them right in the thingy. Anyway, a pretty cute set, so I wanted to share it. I featured the glass on the left in the fall in a video. It's the Crate and Barrel Atwell. Um, I just love this cider orange, very pretty. And it's um, $6.95 at the moment, but I found one that just has similar flavor and it's nice, it would be stackable too. The Better Homes and Gardens Pedestal Drinking Glass in Amber. $2.46 each. I'm going to show you a bunch of throw pillows now. And here I'm showing you kind of the flavor that they are. So this is Pottery Barn's Blue Edit. Um, and I found one that looked a lot like theirs. So this is Walmart's main stage chambray embroidered botanical decorative pillow. It's a lumbar pillow, 14 by 20, and it's only 1147 for the pillow. We're going through our embroidered era at Pottery Barn, and this is one of their new spring pillows. So I wanted to show you one from Walmart that looked very similar. 
It's the Mainstays 100% cotton canvas embroidered ambretta flower pillow. It's 18 by 18 and it has two different fun sides. So you saw the Pottery Barn one had stripes in the pattern. This one has the cute seersucker stripes on the back and on the cord and then the nice embroidered design on the front. So $9.98 for this beauty. This Mainstays embroidered pillow is $14.94. You get the entire pillow, and this one is 18 by 18 as well. This one reverses to just white on the other side, which is kind of nice if you didn't want to get imprints on your cheek if you do happen to lay your head on it. And here we have a sage color pillow with the embroidery. This is by Mainstays as well, $14.94, 18 by 18, and 100% cotton, which is nice, um, but it does have polyester fill. Anyway, very pretty, and I like the plain uh, sage on the back as well. This would look cute on the Drew Barrymore um, swivel chair in sage, but I do prefer the cream one. A stripe look is very trendy right now. And there is a black and white version of this pillow set, and there is a blue and white version. So take your pick. But it's by Better Homes and Gardens. It's feather filled, um, and they're dashed stripes, very light and elegant. Um, so you get two of them for, let's say about $26, because the price has changed several times as I've um, researched it. So about 26 for the two. That'll be the end of our pillow section, <laughs> but I wanted to show you one more thing. It's not a dupe, it's just so cute. It's the black and white cross hatch square baker. Um, there is a nine inch uh, baker and an eight by eight as well. And they're dishwasher safe. They do go in the microwave even though it has a little gold on it. And um, I just thought that they were so adorable, I better share. I have so many fun things to show you coming up soon. I just wanted to save them because I wanted to make this uh, video all about Walmart. Well, I wanna thank you for watching and I appreciate your viewership so much. Um, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe, I wish you would. So come back soon. We'll do another video next Saturday.